Do you have a terrace at home that you're not using to its full potential? If so, why not turn it into a beautiful and productive garden? Terrace gardening is a great way to grow your own food, flowers, and herbs, even if you don't have a lot of space. The first step to terrace gardening is to choose the right plants. Consider the following factors when making your selection. Amount of sunlight. How much sunlight does your terrace get? Some plants need full sun, while others prefer partial shade or even full shade. Climate. What is the climate in your area? Some plants are more tolerant of heat and drought than others. Size. How much space do you have on your terrace? Some plants grow quite large, while others can be grown in small containers. Purpose. Are you growing food, flowers, or herbs? Some plants are edible, while others are grown for their beauty or fragrance. Once you've considered these factors, you can start to narrow down your choices. Here are a few tips for choosing the right plants for your terrace. Choose native plants whenever possible. Native plants are adapted to the climate and soil conditions in your area, so they are more likely to thrive. Mix and match different types of plants to create a visually appealing display. Consider plants of different heights, textures, and colors. Don't forget to include some plants that are beneficial to bees and other pollinators. We've included a list of the plants mentioned in this video's description below. So, if you're seeking for specific plant choices, be sure to check it out. Watering your terrace garden. Water your plants deeply once a week, or more often if the weather is hot or windy. Stick a finger into the soil to see if it's dry before watering. If the top inch of soil is dry, it's time to water. Don't forget to water the plants on the edges of your terrace, as they can dry out more quickly. Fertilizing your terrace garden. Fertilize your plants once a month during the growing season with a balanced fertilizer. Follow the directions on the fertilizer label to apply the correct amount. Be careful not to over-fertilize, as this can damage your plants. Here's an even simpler way to remember. Water your plants when they're thirsty. Feed your plants when they're hungry. Choose the right plants for your terrace. Consider the amount of sunlight, climate, and size of your terrace when making your selections. Prepare your terrace for gardening. This may involve adding raised beds, containers, or pots. You'll also need to make sure that your terrace has adequate drainage. Water and fertilize your terrace garden regularly. Terrace gardens need to be watered more often than traditional gardens, especially during the hot summer months. Fertilize your plants on a regular basis to ensure that they have the nutrients they need to thrive. Maintain your terrace garden by weeding, deadheading flowers, and removing any diseased or damaged plants. Be patient and enjoy the process. Terrace gardening is a rewarding hobby that can provide you with fresh food, flowers, and herbs for years to come. Start small. It's better to start with a few plants that you can easily care for than to try to do too much at once. Don't be afraid to experiment. Try different types of plants and see what works best on your terrace. Be patient. It takes time for plants to grow and produce. Don't get discouraged if you don't see results immediately. That's it for the basics of terrace gardening. With a little planning and care, you can create a beautiful and productive terrace garden that will enhance your home and well-being. So get started today and enjoy the rewards of terrace gardening. What are you waiting for? Start planning your terrace garden today. If you have any questions, be sure to leave a comment below and I'll be happy to help.